In Brazil, the fear and alarm about the Zika virus is intense because of its links to birth defects. After a fact-finding mission there, the head of the World Health Organization had this ominous message. Things can get worse before it gets better. Dr. Chan called the Zika virus a much bigger menace than the Ebola epidemic in West Africa, given the magnitude of Zika's spread and its link to microcephaly, a birth defect that leaves babies at risk of a host of long-term developmental issues. U.S. health officials are stressing the need for funding to continue research on the disease, a vaccine against it, and to help U.S. states and territories prepare for the virus's spread. We need to prepare to respond in Puerto Rico. We need the rest of the U.S. to be ready because travelers will be returning from these affected areas. And we need to work with international partners on the ground to learn as much as we can so that we can protect Americans. The CDC is working with health ministries in Colombia and in Brazil to determine if the virus causes a serious type of paralysis and affects the brains of babies. There have now been several instances in which virus, whole virus, has been actually demonstrated in the brains of these babies who've died at autopsy, as well as in placenta and amniotic fluid. So although all of us are reluctant to say there's definitive evidence, it is really quite strong. Dr. Fauci told members of Congress that the U.S. must be able to respond rapidly to new diseases as they occur. U.S. health agencies were heavily involved in the Ebola outbreak in Africa, the head of the CDC told VOA, while the two viruses are different, having good public health systems in every country around the world is essential. The main lesson from Ebola was that every country has to be prepared to find, stop, and prevent health threats. If we're not, that country is at risk, the region is at risk, their neighbors, and the world is at risk. Zika is a new threat, and scientists don't understand exactly what's happening with it. Much needs to be learned, and learned quickly. Carol Pearson, VOA News, Washington.